गुड मॉर्निंग ऑल ऑफ यू वेलकम टू ऑक्सफर्ड इंग्लिश मीडियम स्कूल चोपड़ा दिस इज संदीप सोनोने टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट द सब्जेक्ट ऑफ इंग्लिश ग्रामर आई हैव सिलेक्टेड द वर्ड टॉपिक ऑफ इंग्लिश ग्रामर दैट इज नाउंस यू नो डियर स्टूडेंट्स व्हाट डू मीन बाय नाउंस व्हेन एवर वी वांट टू कॉल समवन दैट टाइम वी यूज अ वर्ब वर्ड to call that person see the definition of noun a noun is a word used to name things and words and people see for example teacher that is the name of a person milk that is a material noun tiger that is the name of animal then lady that is the name of a place so nouns are divided into this kinds proper noun first is a proper noun common noun abstract noun collective noun and material noun where when we see the first kind of noun that is proper noun you know that we also have a proper name same thing what do you mean by proper noun a proper noun that words denoting the names of particular places or persons are called proper noun you know dear students you also have same uh, your personal name and that name is also known as a proper noun i also have my personal name and you know about that my name is sandeep sona so that is my proper noun place also have the proper noun for example you know chopra that is also the name of place that is also we say proper noun jalgaon india chennai bhopal mahabaleshwar these all is known we say proper noun means see the name of the river that is ganga that is also the proper noun dr rajendra prasad was the was our first president that is also the proper noun and you know about that don't forget it the proper nouns also start with capital letter that start with capital letter see this ganga that word also start with capital letter that g dr rajendra prasad ramayana a god here is the name of a singer that is this see the definition of the collective nouns a collection or groups of people or things of the same kind for example you know team team you know players team for example player football players team cricket players team swam shol school that swam is also known as a group of bees Shoal is also a group of fish. Uh, Shoal is also known as a group of whales. Fish is also a group of sheep. Sheep is also a group of goats. Bird is also known as a group of keys. Band is also known as a group of musicians. And clock is also known as a group of birds. And bird is also known as a group of cows. See the next kind of uh, noun that is means common noun. You know, we are whenever we want to call someone that time we also use a one a common word. For example, boy, girl. Okay, that name we use to common commonly to call someone. For what is the example? What is the definition of this common nouns? See, words denoting persons, places, or things of the same kind or class are called common noun. You know, for example. common nouns example like you know here city okay aunt mountain boy girl doctor books table monuments these are the examples of common noun see the next kind of noun that is abstract noun abstract noun means a noun that refers to the things that we can not touch or see abstract noun is a is a means we can refer the things that which we can not touch and see so what do you mean by uh, abstract noun see the nouns are also the names of a quality names of the quality names of a quality state or concept that means a abstract noun see the example for example love that is a concept kindness that is a quality quality of that person and here reach that is a state or a position truth friendship freedom justice and privacy these are the another example of abstract noun for example he is a nice man 
that is the quality of that person. That person is very honest. See, here is the interview. He was the captain of his team. That is a stick. So, see the next uh, type of noun that is material noun. Material noun means what? The material noun denotes the matter or substances of which things are made. Okay, for example, here is the gold. Okay, that is also, that is made from the particular substance or the matter. Here is the silver, wood, clay, iron, plastic, wool, glass, floor, marble, and quantum steel. This all the nouns for the things which made from particular matter or substances that are the things or the uh, we say that the words or the noun that which is made from the matter or substances. Substances. If you want, I want to uh, tell you, countable nouns are the nouns which we count. Okay, and uncountable nouns are the nouns which we cannot count.